Your life isn't defined by how much you have, but by how much of it you can truly control. Most people spend their days overwhelmed by distractions, chasing more of everything, more success, more possessions, more approval, only to feel more lost in the end. But what if the real power lies not in adding to your life, but in stripping it down? The wisdom of Stoicism shows us that clarity, peace and strength are found in simplicity. In a world that glorifies excess, choosing simplicity is the ultimate act of rebellion. Most people never realize the solutions to their struggles have been within reach all along. They fill their lives with noise, believing that happiness comes from having more. But Stoicism teaches the opposite. True fulfillment is found when you let go of what's unnecessary. Marcus Aurelius once said, very little is needed to make a happy life. It is all within yourself, in your way of thinking. Imagine the freedom that comes when you stop chasing external validation and start focusing on mastering your inner world. Each principle you're about to discover will help you do just that. These time-tested teachings from Stoic philosophy will guide you to live with more intention, less stress, and a deeper sense of purpose. Whether it's learning to control your impulses, simplifying your daily routines, or letting go of attachments that no longer serve you, the power of simplicity can transform every aspect of your life. But this isn't about deprivation. It's about freedom. The more you simplify, the more space you create for what truly matters. In a world where distractions pull you in every direction, this ancient wisdom will help you cut through the noise. The Stoics understood that we waste precious energy on things outside our control, things that ultimately don't matter. By applying these lessons, you'll discover a strength within yourself you never knew existed, a strength that comes from focusing on what's essential and letting go of the rest. So pay close attention. Each lesson holds the key to a profound shift in how you live and think. This isn't just about living with less, it's about living with more focus, more freedom, and more clarity. As you embrace these teachings, you'll begin to see that simplicity is where real power lies. It's time to reclaim your life, one intentional choice at a time. If you're enjoying the channel's videos, please like and subscribe for more life-changing content. Let's begin. Simplicity isn't just a modern trend. It's an ancient practice that has stood the test of time. Stoicism teaches that true peace comes not from adding more to our lives, but from removing the unnecessary. Think about it. How often do we chase after material possessions, only to feel emptier once we have them? The Stoic approach is to focus on what truly matters, the essentials. When you strip away the excess, clarity emerges and life becomes far more manageable. Marcus Aurelius said, Very little is needed to make a happy life. It is all within yourself, in your way of thinking. This idea resonates deeply with the modern minimalist movement, which echoes that joy isn't about having more but needing less. So how can you apply this? Start by evaluating your physical surroundings. Look at your home or workspace and identify what truly adds value to your life. Simplifying doesn't mean getting rid of everything, but keeping only what serves your purpose. In a world full of distractions, simplicity offers freedom. By decluttering your mind and focusing on what's within your control, as Stoicism teaches, you begin to see life differently. Fewer possessions, fewer desires, fewer obligations. This is what opens up space for real fulfillment. Imagine having the mental bandwidth to focus on the things that genuinely bring you joy, like meaningful relationships and personal growth. Isn't that a life worth pursuing? Take a moment to look at the clutter in your digital life as well. How many unnecessary notifications, emails and social media distractions eat up your time daily? Stoic wisdom suggests guarding your time as your most precious asset. Consider a digital detox. Unsubscribe from emails that add no value, limit your screen time and set boundaries for when and how you engage online you'll find that with less clutter, your mind feels lighter. The beauty of simplicity extends to your decisions too. When you focus on fewer things, you make better choices. Decision fatigue is real, and the Stoics knew this. By narrowing your focus on what truly matters, 
you're not just reducing stress, but also increasing your effectiveness in life. Want a practical tip? Create a simple morning routine that sets the tone for your day. Focus on what truly needs to be done, rather than getting lost in trivial tasks. Epicurus, though not a Stoic, shared the belief in simple pleasures. He found joy in nothing more than bread, water and good conversation. This perspective is powerful in today's consumer-driven world, where we're often sold the idea that happiness comes from acquiring more. Next time you're tempted to buy something to feel better, pause and ask yourself, will this bring lasting joy? Most likely the answer is no. Focus instead on cultivating simple, meaningful experiences. In practice, simplicity can be applied in relationships as well. Think of the energy we waste on maintaining superficial connections or worrying about how we're perceived by others. Stoicism encourages us to focus on what's in our control, our own thoughts and actions. So, simplify your social circle. Spend more time with people who genuinely lift you up and align with your values. You'll find that your relationships will become richer and more fulfilling. Emotional simplicity is another layer of this approach. How often do we complicate our feelings by holding on to grudges or overthinking situations? Stoicism teaches us to embrace emotional simplicity by not letting external events dictate our inner peace. This means letting go of what's beyond your control and focusing on how you respond to life's challenges. Next time you feel overwhelmed, ask yourself, is this within my control? If it isn't, practice letting go. Even our aspirations can benefit from the magic of simplicity. Often we set lofty, complicated goals that overwhelm us before we even start. The stoic way is to break down these goals into simple, manageable steps. Want to improve your health? Start by taking a 10-minute walk each day. Want to read more? Dedicate just 15 minutes a night to a book that inspires you. Over time, these small actions lead to big changes without the pressure of overcomplication. Another area where simplicity shines is in how we consume information. In today's world, we're constantly bombarded with news, opinions and data. The Stoic philosopher Seneca warned against drowning in too much information, advising instead to focus on timeless wisdom. Rather than consuming endless streams of content, focus on a few high-quality sources. Read fewer books, but read the right ones. Consider starting with Meditations by Marcus Aurelius or Letters from a Stoic by Seneca. Simplicity in its essence is about removing the noise that keeps us from hearing the deeper truths in life. It's not about deprivation, but about making space for what really matters. When you live simply, you give yourself the chance to focus on your true priorities. Want to start small? Try this. For the next week, pick one area of your life to simplify. Whether it's your wardrobe, your schedule or your mental space, take one step toward living more intentionally. Simplicity is power. It's the strength to strip away what weakens you and to embrace only what fuels your spirit. The Stoics knew that true freedom lies not in wealth or status, but in mastering your inner world. When you shed the excess, you reclaim your life. Every step toward simplicity is a step toward clarity, peace and control. So challenge yourself to simplify, to cut through the chaos of modern life and to live with more meaning and intention. In simplicity you find strength. The simplicity of Epicurus's philosophy teaches us that happiness isn't found in indulgence, but in appreciating the small, meaningful moments of life. He believed that a life of pleasure doesn't mean extravagance, but instead the removal of pain and unnecessary desires. Bread, water and good company were all Epicurus needed to live joyfully, a powerful reminder in today's complex world. It's not about how much you have, but how deeply you appreciate the simple things. Stoicism aligns with this mindset, encouraging us to focus on what we need rather than what we want. Excess leads to distraction and dissatisfaction, while simplicity brings peace. Think about your daily life. How many of your pursuits are truly essential? Are they bringing you peace, or are they only adding stress? The Stoic approach is to streamline, to focus on what's essential and let go of the rest. Your mind, like your life, benefits from being uncluttered. 
A practical way to apply this is by simplifying your meals. Epicurus found joy in something as basic as bread, reminding us that sustenance doesn't need to be complex. Try planning simpler meals for the week, wholesome, nutritious, and easy to prepare. This not only clears up time and mental energy, but allows you to appreciate the food for what it is, rather than what it could be. In stripping away the excess, you might just rediscover the pleasure of eating. The Stoics often emphasized the importance of reducing desires. Seneca once noted that, it is not the man who has too little, but the man who craves more, that is poor. This shift in perspective teaches us to look at our cravings, to understand which are necessary and which are simply distractions. By reducing these unnecessary desires, we can simplify not just our physical lives, but our mental and emotional landscapes as well. Imagine taking the time to savor a conversation, much like Epicurus did. In today's world, we're often distracted by devices or overwhelmed by busyness. But Stoicism, much like Epicureanism, invites us to focus on the present moment and the people around us. Put away your phone during your next meal or conversation. Fully engage with the person you're speaking to. You'll find that in the simplicity of true connection, there's a profound joy to be found. The beauty of Epicurus's philosophy lies in the fact that happiness isn't something you need to chase. It's already within reach, available to anyone, regardless of wealth or status. Stoics believe this too. They taught that happiness isn't about accumulating things, but about refining the self. In this way, we return to simplicity. Think of the last time you felt truly content. Was it because of something external, or was it something internal, something simple? Even our financial pursuits can benefit from this philosophy of simplicity. How often do we believe that happiness lies in earning more, buying more, and achieving more? But Stoicism reminds us that wealth, like any other external, is neither good nor bad. It's how we use it that matters. Simplifying your financial life by focusing on needs rather than wants can bring a sense of control and peace. Consider reviewing your expenses and cutting out what isn't essential. The power of simplicity extends to how we spend our time as well. The Stoics often reflected on the fleeting nature of life, urging us to prioritize what truly matters. How many hours do we waste on trivial pursuits? To live simply is to reclaim your time. Take stock of your daily activities and ask yourself, which ones are essential, which ones bring real fulfillment? The goal is to eliminate the distractions that keep you from living with purpose. Epicurus's philosophy also teaches us that pleasure doesn't have to come from grand experiences. It can be found in the little things. Next time you're outside, take a moment to enjoy the feeling of the sun on your skin or the sound of the wind through the trees. Stoicism invites us to appreciate nature's simplicity as a source of joy and calm. In a world that constantly pushes us to want more, stepping back and enjoying life's small natural pleasures can be revolutionary. Even our financial pursuits can benefit from this philosophy of simplicity. How often do we believe that happiness lies in earning more, buying more and achieving more? But Stoicism reminds us that wealth, like any other external, is neither good nor bad. It's how we use it that matters. Simplifying your financial life by focusing on needs rather than wants can bring a sense of control and peace. Consider reviewing your expenses and cutting out what isn't essential. The power of simplicity extends to how we spend our time as well. The Stoics often reflected on the fleeting nature of life, urging us to prioritize what truly matters. How many hours do we waste on trivial pursuits? To live simply is to reclaim your time. Take stock of your daily activities and ask yourself, which ones are essential, which ones bring real fulfillment? The goal is to eliminate the distractions that keep you from living with purpose. Epicurus's philosophy also teaches us that pleasure doesn't have to come from grand experiences. It can be found in the little things. Next time you're outside, take a moment to enjoy the feeling of the sun on your skin or the sound of the wind through the trees. Stoicism invites us to appreciate nature's simplicity as a source of joy and calm. In a world that constantly pushes us to want more, 
Stepping back and enjoying life's small natural pleasures can be revolutionary. This simplicity of living isn't about deprivation, it's about finding what's truly valuable and letting go of the rest. For Epicurus, it was the simple pleasure of a meal with friends. For a Stoic, it's living according to nature, focusing on what's within your control and discarding what isn't. There's a profound freedom in that. The more we learn to strip away, the more space we create for what truly matters. In modern life, this can look like simplifying your schedule. Are your days packed with obligations that don't bring you closer to your goals? As Epictetus said, it is impossible to begin to learn that which one thinks one already knows. Clear your calendar of the unessential so that you can focus on learning, growth and deepening your understanding of what truly matters. In doing so, you'll create space for personal transformation. Simplicity is not a path of denial but a doorway to true abundance. When you strip away what doesn't matter, you make room for what does, clarity, purpose and inner peace. Epicurus and the Stoics understood that by focusing on life's essentials we gain strength and control over our desires. It's in the quiet, uncomplicated moments where real power lies. Embrace simplicity and you'll discover that everything you've been searching for is already within your grasp. Modern minimalism is a direct reflection of Stoic principles, emphasizing the importance of cutting away what is unnecessary to focus on what truly matters. The clutter in our lives, whether physical, mental or emotional, creates distractions that keep us from pursuing what's essential. The more we accumulate, the more we have to manage, and the more our minds get tied up in things that don't bring us real fulfillment. Simplifying means reclaiming focus and creating space for clarity. The Stoics, like Marcus Aurelius, taught us to guard our attention, to protect our minds from being overwhelmed by external distractions. You have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this and you will find strength. When we declutter our homes or our lives, we're doing more than just creating physical space. We are practicing a kind of mental discipline. This isn't about perfection, but about creating an environment where you can think clearly and live intentionally. Take a moment to look around your living space. Are the things you surround yourself with serving a purpose, or are they just taking up space? Minimalism invites you to let go of what doesn't serve you, just like Stoicism asks you to release what you cannot control. Start with one area, a closet, a shelf, and ask yourself, does this add value to my life? If the answer is no, let it go. You'll be surprised by how freeing it feels to live with less. Minimalism also applies to how we manage our time and commitments. The Stoics often spoke about the value of time and how much of it we waste on things that don't truly matter. In the same way, Minimalism teaches us to prioritize what's important and say no to what isn't. Are your days filled with obligations that drain you rather than energize you? Simplify your schedule by focusing only on what aligns with your goals and values. Life is too short to be spent on things that don't bring you joy or purpose. Modern minimalists often speak of the joy of missing out, a counter to the fear of missing out, FOMO, that plague so many people today. The Stoics would agree. They taught that peace comes from focusing on what's essential and not being swayed by external pressures. When you stop trying to keep up with others or accumulate more just for the sake of it, you gain a sense of freedom. You can focus on what really matters, your health, your relationships and your growth. In today's world, where we are constantly bombarded with information and choices, minimalism becomes a tool for reclaiming control. Stoicism reminds us that our attention is one of our most valuable resources and minimalism helps us protect it. A practical way to do this is by reducing your exposure to unnecessary information, whether it's from social media, the news, or even people who bring negativity into your life. Curate what you allow into your mental space, just as you would your physical space. Consider how minimalism can enhance your decision-making process. By reducing the number of choices you need to make each day, you preserve mental energy for what really matters. The Stoics understood the importance of this, 
They advocated for simplicity in actions and choices. For example, you can simplify your wardrobe by adopting a capsule closet where you only keep a few versatile pieces. This not only saves time but also removes the stress of decision-making in the morning, allowing you to focus on more meaningful tasks. Minimalism isn't about living with nothing, it's about living with intention. Just as the Stoics valued living in accordance with nature and reason, minimalism encourages us to live in alignment with our values. Ask yourself, what do I truly need to live well? You might find that the answer is much simpler than you think. Strip away the excess and focus on the basics, your health, your peace of mind, and your sense of purpose. When you embrace minimalism, you begin to realize that happiness isn't found in having more, but in needing less. This aligns perfectly with Stoic teachings, which emphasize contentment with what we have. Epictetus once said, Wealth consists not in having great possessions, but in having few wants. Minimalism helps you live this truth by reducing the external noise and allowing you to focus on the internal. Even in relationships, minimalism can have a profound impact. The quality of your relationships is more important than the quantity. Just as Stoicism advises us to cultivate meaningful connections, minimalism encourages us to invest deeply in a few important relationships rather than spreading ourselves thin across many. Simplify your social life by focusing on those who genuinely support and uplift you and let go of superficial ties that drain your energy. As you continue to declutter your life, you'll find that minimalism isn't just a physical practice. It's a mental and spiritual one. The less you have to manage, the more mental space you have for reflection, growth and understanding. Stoicism encourages us to reflect on our thoughts and actions daily, and minimalism provides the quiet space to do so. With fewer distractions, you can focus on what truly matters, your character, your purpose and your path in life. Minimalism is more than a trend, it's a pathway to freedom. By removing the excess, you create space for clarity, purpose and peace. The Stoics knew this, and modern minimalism is simply a continuation of that ancient wisdom. When you embrace simplicity, you unlock a power that comes from within, a strength that allows you to live life fully on your own terms, without the weight of unnecessary burdens holding you down. After all these teachings, the real question is, what will you do with this knowledge? The power of a simple life isn't something you read about, it's something you live. By now, you've seen how much of your life is weighed down by the unnecessary, the distractions that keep you from reaching your true potential. Stoicism reminds us that freedom and strength come from simplifying, from cutting away what doesn't matter to focus on what does. Imagine the life you could live if you embraced these principles fully. What could you accomplish if you stopped chasing things outside of your control and instead mastered your own mind and actions? The Stoics have already given you the blueprint. It's up to you to apply it. What will you let go of today? Is it that toxic relationship, the fear of judgment or the clutter that fills your home? The path to simplicity starts with one brave decision to change. Remember, simplicity isn't about deprivation, it's about empowerment. The less you hold on to, the stronger you become. Each step you take towards simplifying your life is a step toward greater clarity and peace. Let me know you've made it here by commenting, focus. Because that's what this journey is all about, learning to focus on what truly matters. In a world that pulls you in every direction, the power to focus is the key to unlocking your best self. What will you choose to simplify next? What's the one thing you can remove from your life today that will bring you closer to the freedom you seek? These questions aren't just for now, they're for every day moving forward. The wisdom of Stoicism isn't a one-time solution, it's a lifelong practice. The more you embrace it, the more you'll discover how much power lies in simplicity. So go ahead, start applying these lessons. Let go of what doesn't serve you, and remember, the simpler your life becomes, the more powerful you will feel.